A lot of people ask me why I don't count down the best and worst games reviewed by GamePro. Believe it or not, there's a really simple answer to that question, and it's that they simply give out too many perfect scores. No, really! Between 1990 and 1996, GamePro Magazine gave 400 games a perfect 5 out of 5. You heard me, 400! It was 113 in 1993 alone! Obviously, there is no way to narrow that down to a top 10 list. But that doesn't mean that I don't want to talk about one of video gaming's longest running magazines. Today we're going to embark on a long form series where I pull some of the silliest, craziest, funniest, and most baffling GamePro quotes of all time. You see, GamePro had this weird habit of trying to end each of their reviews with a pun or a joke, most of which were pretty cringy. It's actually something that I find to be incredibly endearing. So forget about the full reviews and even the scores, because I'm just going to pull out the best bits from a wide variety of games that we usually don't talk about. Folks, I hope you brought your fancy shoes, because we're about to induct a few of the great moments in Game Pro. It's time to make things shrink. Just say the magic word. Shrinking! That's right, Bob. You know, for one thing, the kitchen, it's too dark. It seems like only yesterday she was a little girl. You have so many precious memories. Now you can treasure those memories forever with loving steps. You haven't lived and died, and lived and died, and lived and died until you've tried Contra. Keep your head clear, don't drink any radioactive water, and you'll be out of the mansion before you can say, come up to the lab and see what's on the slab. Ready to take on the drug runners and some control-crunching jungle gunslinging? The gang's all here. Abadox is a gutsy game packed with pixel-popping fun. He Lieutenant Nasal's last words. Through the lips and over the gums, look out Parasitus, here I come. Lola's really in trouble this time, but Lola will get her back. After all, whatever Lola wants, Lola gets. If you're a die-hard shoot 'em up fan and looking for a challenge, then this one's for you. Remember, in space, no one can hear you scream. The wild blue yonder was never wilder. This game won't let you down, video jet jockeys. It just shoots you down. In the end, it takes brawn and brains to succeed, and you're more likely to end up with a headache than a backache. If you're looking for some truly cross-cultural entertainment, look no further. Alex is in a tight spot, but we all know that he has the stuff to come out on top. Remember, tricks are for a kid. And remember, it's going to take more than a fly swatter to squash a bunch of voracious vermin. But we know you won't let that bug you. If you're tough enough to take on the hardcore inner city streets for some heavy duty jungle ball, jump on that joystick and give this all new 7800 cart a shot. In your face, your eyes, your stomach, your mouth, your... I'd like to wrap some more with you, but the pizza delivery dude is at the door. And I want to get there before those other guys do. Sometimes they're more like pigs than turtles, you know. Although the graphics are a little small, you may end up blind as a bat. The gameplay for Sunsoft's Batman is excellent. Holy Game Boy Batman! Fortress of Fear is a great Game Boy adventure. If you like puzzling levels and fast-paced gameplay, give it a go. But don't let that old black magic put you in its spell. Keep your board moving and use your wits about you, or else this game becomes die or die. Cute, clever, acrobatic, these guys have it all, so be prepared to run the gamut of emotions when you try to match wits with these rotund pranksters. As Shakespeare's Macbeth says, out, out darn spot. Here's a martial arts cart that emphasizes the art over the martial without scrimping on the action. Budokan is a smash that ought to give other fighting carts a swift kick in the pants. When it comes to strategy and fast action, Target Earth has it all. If you like to space out, this is the game for you. You just might find yourself addicted to this cart. Remember, when you start flapping around your house and clanging to the furniture, then you know it's time to put the game down. Hey, thanks for watching this debut episode of Great Moments in Game Pro. If you liked what you saw here, then you should know that we post new reviews and features almost every day. 
Now here's the question I have for you. What's your favorite game featured in this episode? We covered three issues in 1990, and there were some genuine classics. I love Maniac Mansion, Contra, Codename Viper. Ugh, it's a tough choice. I can't wait to see your picks in the comments below. In other news, we're going to be posting a movie-related quiz just in time for the Oscars. Also, I'm going to do a rare update video outlining some of my plans for the next few months, so please tune in for that. In the meantime, I strongly recommend you click that subscribe button and support what we're doing here. Until then.